Well, I think the best place to start for people who may not be familiar with the Wayseer movement is what is a Wayseer? So Wayseers, by definition, are simply people who have are very open. The easiest way to understand Wayseers is ones who are not who do not have a lot of neurological repression. Neurological repression is the stuff that goes on inside your brain that stops thoughts and impulses from the subconscious and the unconscious mind from entering your conscious awareness. If you don't have a lot of neurological repression, then you're open to flashes of insight, to inappropriate impulses, but then also sort of miraculous impulses, the impulses that athletes describe when they're in the zone. You have an openness to distracting ideas. You might be a visual thinker and all sorts of daydreams pop into your mind. So it's a blessing and a curse to be a wayseer. And what a wayseer is, is one who, because you're not repressed, because your mind allows you to see beyond what your conscious sort of social and cultural programming is designed to allow you to see, because you've gotten past that censoring agent in your brain, you have the ability to receive great inspiration and perceive what I'm calling the way. And the way is that ineffable intelligence that all of us in one way or another recognizes there and has been described as many different things. Some people call the way God or God's will. Others uh, who don't believe in God recognize the way in great art and great innovation and elegant mathematical solutions. So the way is ever present in all of our experiences and way seers are the ones who are open to really seeing the way consciously.